Access to clean water is not a luxury, but a necessity and a basic human right. But this important commodity is not readily available in most compounds in Lusaka. George compound in particular is one area that has had a problem of water for some time now. Because this important commodity is not readily available here in George compound, some residents have opted to dig in shallow wells in order to access water. These residents have also called on the area member of parliament and government in particular to ensure that the issue of water is prioritized as government starts spearheading its programs. Mans tiri bemuka jim mans yamangala yo vuti oti songere mans upesa ti mans kulibe ti songere mbati makadi yango enda cha bendera mbazi enda cha beno mans. I'm appealing to my area member of parliament. I think the issue of water has to take it very serious at now, so that we see that water is available to each and everybody in our community because water is a necessity, not as a business. Kufika kapela ni one hour che kwa sila. So mans ama chita ala uche ten containers. Manje big family siya kwa nisika manzi aja. Njie problem niti nae kuno kwa atu kuno. So any time tika kana ndirama tiza fukulula. Tiza kuti tizi tizu inzi ngako manzi. Tiza fukulula futi. Taba tupela kuna ngu ya mwame nshikuno yu. So tulapo mpia nishe tifu ya huti ya tu. Tu chite pami kwa huti pene. Pagata tukwe tifu ya kuchita. Elo mwishita imbi pa huti kwa tifu ya ya kuno. Tulamu kupulamu ma industry isu. It is unfortunate that for seven years after independence, some areas, even in the capital city like Lusaka, still access water through shallow wells. If this state of affairs remains unchecked, diseases such as cholera, that are seemingly becoming a perennial disease in Zambia, will not be available.